Good evening, everybody. How are you all doing? And welcome to, for some of you, the first time you'll be witnessing me using a pre stream title card. The music that I chose there, some of you in the Doom community will recognize it, but it is the track from Sword of Fest 2013, Map 30 Chrono Blast in which the instrumental MIDI is actually far better than the song it's based off. <laughs> is this going to be a long one? Uh, we'll see. We will see. Um, it's going to be an interesting one, that's for sure. So I'll be doing these pre-stream cards from now on before the start of every stream. And ideally, hopefully, I will get a much more better picture soon. But basically... If you want to create any kind of fan art or whatever, you don't have to necessarily be very good at making images, as you can clearly see by this submission by Mega Lego Smuggler. You just have to make something. I, can, I will put it at this point. So, yeah. Welcome. And welcome to not being able to see anything. Okay, we, that's a bit awkward. There we go. That's better. So... You are polishing up your maps for Nanowad and Razorly Adderwing difficulties. Oh, people are going to appreciate that. They're going to appreciate that, Alba. They're going to appreciate the difficulties. Nowadays, difficulty settings are definitely more of a thing, really. They didn't used to be for years, but they're more of a trend these days, I think. Because there's all kinds of people still playing Doom and, you know, <laughs> make some maps that I can beat. <laughs> I don't <laughs> We can't all play on Ultra Island, you know. Not for everything. So, um, I have decided to choose something I've had my eye on for a little bit. I will probably be doing the Iron Mans quite soon, since both Iron Eagle and Iron Man are now out. So, I will be probably covering those quite soon, actually. But first, checkbox. What is checkbox? Well, it's a community project organized on the Liquid Doom forum and has been mostly prepared by the same people as a previous project called Zones of Fear, which was released in 2012, and also some guys without any significant experience. They tried to focus on small or medium-sized maps, so don't expect maps with thousands of enemies like Zones of Fear had. All maps should be compatible using Doom Doom Top 1. So basically, uh, from what I gather, this is kind of a sort of a, as I'm dubbing it, the Czech Republic Community Project, you know. And as longtime viewers will know, I quite like the idea of playing a Doom Ward made by one specific community of players. I mean, the Japanese community project, I believe, needs no real introduction for how good that was. But there was also Cabro's Legacy, which was the Spanish uh, Doom community. And that was an interesting experience, actually, especially since it was um, divided by years and it was based on a competition. You know, I kind of like the idea of playing a Doom ward that is by one specific uh, country of people. To see what kind of things, you know. And, and then, of course, there's been the Russian projects I've played too. You know, like uh, White Mare 1 and 2. Uh, some of the boss stuff, obviously, was Russian-themed as well. So, this caught my attention randomly a few months ago. And I just decided to keep an eye on it. And it's actually... I Surprisingly, they, I think they released this in September. And... There's not been a single bit of feedback, apparently, since it was released. Other than to say that one of the maps wasn't original, I don't think anyone has actually really played this. I mean, the last post on the thread was September 20th by the uh, OP Dam, he's called, he or she. Uh, a few people... Um, okay, so a few people did actually sort of comment on it initially, I guess. It was like Keyboard Doomer, Matthias, World of Confetti. And then that was kind of it. 
they basically just released it, a few people played it, and then bam. In terms of the thread, it just went quiet after a few days. Oh, you're playing Co-op Survival. Hey, Dubs, how you doing? And as well to you, Primulus, and Draugun, and Alpa, and anyone else who's working at the moment. <laughs> and for those watching on the uh, archive in, 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 the, in the future. Hello there. <laughs> how was a few hours later suiting you? So, okay, a few people did play this. Shows how out, out of touch with the different community I've been recently. But, yeah, I was kinda, I'm kind of curious about these kinds of projects. I mean, it's always nice to, you know, you might find some interesting new mappers. So, this one has a, a, a list of mappers. The uh, original, the LP Damned made 12 maps, apparently. Then we have Enkele with 11, Sulfurit with 3, Jaden with 3, Pipix, who I believe is a name I'm familiar with, sort of. I don't know if it's been around a while. I'm sure that name is familiar. Clocky38 and Muzalek. So... As far as I'm concerned, I haven't really played anything from these mappers before that I can recall. So I'm going into this very blind. I've not even seen any um, images. I've not seen any streams, videos, whatever. I've seen nothing. I just like the idea of this being a sort of Czech Republic community project and decided to play it. So I'm being a little bit selfish. I'm not doing the request list stuff, but as I said, there's a couple of these I do have lined up that aren't on the list. There is also going to be at some point a playthrough of Map Witch, Nova 3, whenever that comes out, and oh, gee, that's it, just those three. <laughs> and of course, obviously, stupid wee big Louise is right back to our next episode 3, and Elementalism, that's next year, and... Uh, other stuff I can think of. Alright, so... And the best part of it is we go in completely blind and we get to see some new mappers and we get to see what the Czech Republic can do in terms of mapping. The Doom. You know? So we got a lot of credits here. Community Chest 4. Uh, Community Chest 4. Soon to be replaced by the Great Otex Revolution. For years to come. I mean, I'm sure Community Chest 4 will still be used, but Otex will probably be the new widely used material now that it's been out for a bit. I know I've seen one or two mapping streams already on Twitch where people use Otex, so it is being used by everyone, because why the fuck would you not at this point? Uh, it looks like Damned also created some graphics as well, and as did Eardrop. So... Yeah, I don't really know what I'm going to be in for here. I mean, they say the maps are going to be small, so could this be... I don't think this is going to be a one-stream ward. I'm not expecting it to be a TBR or a Perdition's Gate or a Doom Jr. Or something else I can't think of at the top right now. I expect this to be interesting. So... Let's play. I'm turning off mouse look and compatibility wise. It said it was designed for boom, right? Maybe I should play with boom strict enabled for this one. Since it was tested in boom, so we'll go with the boom compatibility and see how that goes. Right, let's play and see what we're in for. I have no map list, by the way. At all. Hey Kinny how are you doing? I have no map list, so I don't know what the map name is going to be, all the music, all the mapper until I play the map. I'm too young for beer. Hey. Meth the Lifster. Oh, you're so funny, Kinnikos. You're so very punny. Ward Sergeant's going to be jealous. He's going to be out of a job. Rock the checkbox, rock the checkbox. Let's play. I don't even know if pistol start is or continuous is the way to go with this. I'd imagine this is probably gonna be. Well, that is either a check word or well. 
Well, let's just say that sets a bit of an immature tone for proceedings. Entry gay. Safe is the best to check Doom Streamer. All right, Safe should really cop on by then, and he can tell me. That could actually be a word, but I'm willing to admit that I'm willing to guess the mapper meant to make a pun there. Like entry gay. Get it. Oh, okay. No exit for me. Oh, there's another one. Alright, lots of mini detail here. Very tightly packed now. Ain't it? Ouch face on map one. Yeah, I'm gonna assume this is probably continuous design. Face, man. I'm in your face. Oh, I got a rocket launcher. Wait, look at the auto map. I don't think it is a community project, though, in that sense. Well, I don't know. I mean, there's no specific detail showing whether it's pistol start or continuous. What about the other map? Don't see anything there particularly. Well, there's the exit. Some nice light. Before it was in the shape of a flower. Yeah, no, I don't think it is. So you reckon it should be a pistol stop? Oh, what? Something. Oh, there we go. Yeah. You can have a community project that has different, that is continuously designed dubs. It really depends. Well, I'm sure either way is fine, but it's probably pistol start. Well, you could be right. But then... Okay, backpack, rocket, sure. So, that was by Sue Furitz. Because if it was, then entry gay is to put on nose gay. Nah, I think it was which we just... Let's just swap the W for a G. Oh, look at that, the Czech Republic uh, flag in the background there. It took me a moment to realise that. <laughs> well, there you go, Czech pride, right? Not a bad first level, honestly. I'm gonna recheck the... Sorry, I'm gonna recheck the, the thing for a moment. I do have it saved here on the bar. Let's see if it says anything about that. Uh, just gonna check the thread over to see if it says anything about pistol starts or whatnot. Uh, do, do. By the way, map range survival apparently is much more display player stuff. Let's play this one time, use the one time teleporters. Going to push pop survival compatibility. Play the maps. Oh, okay. So. Cock 
can't wait to find out what innuendo underhauls will be. Hello, Dave. How you doing? I see you were I see you were ranting against Twitter the other day, saying it was crap. Not a bad first map though. Oh no, sorry, it's ruins. Hmm. Yeah, I think we will be pistol starting. If you see, if you, the, the sign for that is that if you see a shotgun in the um, starboard level, that usually means pistol starts are accommodated. If it's usually like just placed right there. So, hey, Zerp One, it's a new round before. Now, nah, maybe that was just. Hey, it's a one off pun. It's different mappers. Whatever. Uh oh. And thank you for the follow, Hazmatoxic. Much appreciated. Doom community theme pack around fetishes. Well, if you can get enough people for that Zerp one, you go ahead and make it. I think he will probably struggle though, I suspect. But you can most definitely try if you want. But yeah, thanks for the follow. This is a decent chunk of my content, but I do also play other games as well. Uh, I am currently playing through the Spyro uh, Reignited Trilogy up to the last game in that. But Doom Wards, you'll see plenty of those. I think I just mean shitty innuendos. So, does is map quality gonna be like a secondary requirement versus like just make a really just make a really basic map, but come up with the the the, the derpiest innuendo you can think of? What nice waterfalls here? Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I guess there's also H-Doom, which pretty much probably does care to most fetishes. More than likely. Oh. All that just to go all the way around. Ah! Is that it? That's a bit... That's a bit lacking, isn't it? Could have used a few more enemies for that. That needed a few more enemies, honestly. That was about three white. This is better, though. Once we get inside, it's a little better. But. I think maybe they are. Is that? Oh. It's not an invisible wall. That thing is only way out. I didn't watch much Spyro since I have still to play it myself. Did I 100% everything? Yep, I did. I had an attack of the I had an attack of Treetops PDSD in the first game, and the second one was a lot better. It's a nice emplacement there. We don't like those gaps being there. I know it's down on the other side too. I think you should probably just 
You probably should just have blocked both of them up. There's no real need to have them there unless it's... If you're going to provide the scenic view, then make sure that the height is above the sky texture cutoff. Or just don't bother. It just looks a bit wonky in that regard. I'm, I also have to state, by the way, before I get too far into this, this is not actually a final version. This is a version uh, 0 0.7, a release candidate, but apparently they were configuring stuff for survival and multiplayer a bit. So, there may well be another version that gets released. I'm kind of hoping that by playing this, I get it a bit of exposure, a few more people play it, and this helps them. Alright, this map was alright. I think there could have been a few more enemies with the reveal of the wooden walls coming down. It just felt a bit lacking. Just about two or three more enemies would have been perfect, because the rest of the ruin area looked nice, but that initial reveal needed more punch to it, in my opinion. Okay, I think that was just one map by me. It's one map. It's not all going to be gay jokes. See? It's the same mapper and he's doing a map called Excavations. Nothing to see here. Move along. Hey, Manchus. Yep, checking out the checkbox. That's right. Lots of nice mini details on this so far. <laughs> Yay! Oh, this is different. I won. Fight you scrubs. Yeah, that's what you want to do. Come on. Ripped him apart in seconds. Might be a bit hard to get another one going here, so I'll just kill them now. Not a bad use of barons, honestly. Mostly because of the presence of the barrels makes this a little trickier. The room is, this is a nice use of barrels. So glad that arch foul is stuck on his throat. Always oh, be 
days to make sure. Oh, again, lots of nice little details everywhere. It looks like we are going to... We're not going to have any maps that look... Where near are we going? We're getting some decently small looking maps. secrets that time either <laughs> all right that was nice map nice four barons it's so hard to get but it's so hard to use barons well especially I mean a small map suits the barons but that was a spacious enough room with some nice barrel placement sticking with this mapper the Chapel of Baphomet we are pistol starting. It may it may be designed for continuous, it may not, but I see enough reason here to bust out the old pistol start. So pistol start is what we will get. Boom compatibility is what we will get. I just teleported. What? I was not expecting. Hey, check this guy out, everyone. Hey, Mr. Mina. Wow. Oh, good. At least some of the damage wasn't absorbed by the boom block. I am playing this in boom compatibility mode. Something I will probably start doing, as I've said before, Trying to play these wards in a appropriate compatibility setting. Boom block. Well, it's technically it's does can Yeah, block map. The boom block. I don't say because I'm in boom camp, uh, I don't really have any actual reason to be saying such a thing, really. Well, well, what a nice secret that is. Yeah, I, I, I know that also. Oh god, I can't seem to be getting headway here. Don't worry, can't aim either. A secret Mega Spear, that is. Dang it, I teleported again. I keep bumping onto this teleport, which I think is the middle of the room, honestly. I just can't stop myself, I just gotta go for that teleport again. Nice. Nice misdemeanor. Have you hit a thousand yet? This is an art file. Nope, it's big old. It's better than the time. So, oh, down to 16 away. Hey, everyone! Go follow Mr. Mina. He's close to a thousand followers. 
Also, he likes to drink lots of monster energy stuff. Oh no, not monster energy. G fuel. So, if you want to see what a... Uh... He's powered by G fuel. And bows. He also plays Doom Lords. Usually for long periods of time. He's very committed. Like... It's like, if you want to watch a Doom stream, but for like eight hours, maybe more, Mr. Mina is the streamer to watch. And this map was nice as well. I could, uh, first map by the OP and leader. Also, props to the fact we're not having Doom 2 music, at least so far. We have custom choices and stuff. I don't blame you. That was some wookie woe. Well, I was gonna say that was some wookie woe damage shotgun rolls. Then I saw pinkies and I cried. I wept. have to be a little more cunning here. That's the Pinky Sandwich Brigade. Wants me to find that. Whoa! What are you not... What are you not fighting there? Yeah, I'll wink it. Oh god, there's still a few too many. Yeah, this is a probably... Ow! Imp. This is a little stressful. Wow. Pistol start, these pinkies are a... Alright, if they can't open that door, I'll just leave them there. Oh no! They weren't how to use a door! No! Cursed smart pingies. They must just use their they must they must use their teeth. <laughs> like rah, you know they or maybe they just slightly tap against it. I don't know how I don't know how pingies open doors. It looks different in Zadim. Yeah, everything looks different in Zadim. Everything looks different in Zadim. Yeah, the like, it's like when those robots can open doors, except it's demons. They were not open doors. I'm not gonna kill those imps just yet, I just wanna take care of the pistol guy. Hey, mate, how you doing? Oh, hi, Revenants. How many whales? Good war if this place exists. Wow, I chose a very bad time to save. Holy shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, wow. Hello. Obake. Hello. Obake's mom. I guess I'll have to be very, uh, I'll just have to be careful with my words now.
Oh yeah, Obake's mom. Uh, Obake promised me $200 the other month, and he still owes me, so if he could just sort of withhold his uh, rent money until he pays me, that'd be great, thanks. I don't think it works. Hira or Barke is getting told off right now. What do you mean you paid the streamer $200? You pay your debts! Oh, Barke! I don't want to pay him! I want to waste my Doom Ward! Yeah, again... It's not so bad here, arguably, but then you got this just this patch here. It looks so weird. I mean, this is something that needs to be worked on. Second time I've come across this now. Gotta make sure you patch up those things. I mean, unless you're going for a voidy effect, that just looks really rubbish. I have the best nagging housewife voice ever. Oh no, lost souls. Oh no, cacodemons. Oh no, I'm dying. Good thing I can run off. Oh, he did consider that. Oh shit. Now, I guess that's why he covers the infested helipad, huh? Because it's infested with things. You hate lost souls. Lost souls can be a pain in specific situations. That was a very well damaged cacto fireball. That's what you get for trying to con a viewer's money off his mom. So, such a horrible person, I'd probably deserve that. Yeah, the Lost Souls have a lot of HP. I've sort of just got used to it, but admittingly, when you see that Lost Souls can have less health and still be a pain in the ass, there is a case where you could say, yeah, maybe the Lost Souls health could be, like, significantly less. Oh, no, just... Hey, what's so? Get lost! I just realized I'm picking up the I'm picking up the box of twenty when I don't need to. I need to not do that. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, pain animals are much more painful because they su they supply a, uh, a a potentially never-ending supply of the lost souls. That was close. Oh no, they're coming through the windows, which I guess they can fit through. Just. Certainly made sure to design this map so you couldn't necessarily hide in these sections. I 
enemies here too. Oh. Hi, Mewi, your dad owes me $200. Maybe. All right, I'll stop trying to con a Vargas family. Do I want to go over there? Yeah, why not? Oh no! In my foolishness, I realized that I can't escape. It's a good thing I saved before making this suicidal dash off the ledge. Dang! How old? How old is Millie? Just out of white curiosity. Why is I am really, I'm going to have to be careful with the language a little bit. Yeah, inescapable pits suck. Chain gun is on both sides of the platform. <laughs> Working at you, Thompson and Fiery. God, not this situation again. I didn't even press the button yet. No, I don't think Yeah, I don't think Romero made the chasm. Oh hey, what there we go. Now I can grab this key. It's a nice staircase. And leave. <laughs> you really don't like Sandy. Gotta watch your language, Mr. Mina. Obake, Obake's Mormon. Watching. We can't. We can't swear anymore. We must be sensible. What was that weird noise? That's odd. I must have been a rev rock here on the save or whatever. All right. Yeah, you will. You will apologize. Won't somebody think of the children and mums? Oh, Baron! The best Baron. Is he missing about... Oh, 
weapon enemies, unless this is not the end either. Oh, it isn't. Yeah, what is this? What is this, Plutonian? Archvale 2. Sewing out. Hi now, Paul. There is a mother and child watching. We can't be rude anymore. We cannot swear. We must just use alternate language. Like, that situation was a whole lot of yikes. Right there. This is Plutonia Jr. Hey, Deadburst, how you doing? Nah, I, can't, I, I couldn't sew out like that, Pineapple. My my no profanity thing long term would last about three streams, and then I'd probably snap, and then it would be like, look at this horrible streamer and his foul language. Banned from Twitch. <laughs> hey, Jackson, Powerwolf, and Deadburst. How you all doing? Welcome to Checkbox. We have to be family friendly until a barcade gets his mum and little girl away from the stream. Then we can go back to normal. So I have to put on my happy face. That was a fun map. A bit harder than the others though. Hey, give me some help. This is close quarters. I want a shotgunners. Spamming the pistol is, um, saved my life, though, I think. Oh, no, no, I, be I better change the blood to green. Is that actually an option in this? Oh, hold on. Can I change the blood color? Uh, let's see. Blood try... No, first try... Oh. Is that an option to change blood color? That should be a hilarious option. That should be allowed. Oh, gameplay option. No, I want, I want, I want the blood to be green. Yeah, no, that's not really an option, is it? Let's face it. It's not an option. It's just not an option here. Oh my good lord, that's a lot of chain gunners. That is a lot of chain gunners, I said. I think we're gonna have to redo the start the level again because that's way too many changes to make sure I have 22 HP. Somehow. Maybe 37's enough. <laughs> I don't know. This is maternal correctness gone mad. Phobos and teleporter aren't bad words. Okay, let's see if 37% chance is any better. Uh... Oh, hang on, hang on. Maybe... Maybe... Yes? I can't see a damn thing, but this might work. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, super shotgun. Bad words like Doom Guy repelled down to hell. Phobos is not a bad word. That's a moon on Mars. God damn it. Yeah, we can. We can that's, that's a good thing about the stream. We're, we're killing demons, so we don't have to worry about, you know, playing a violent game in the first place. Now to change the game to check sports. <laughs> We're killing those demons, Millie. We're killing all the demons. Millie and Obake's mom. See? Look. No, we're not dogs. They are demons. 
horrible, evil people. And no, you can't pet them. You can't pet them. You don't want to pet... Well, you wouldn't want to pet a pinky anyway. They're horribly muscular and they bite. It's about the worst combination of a pet you can get. very problematic, isn't it? He gently, he gently strolled down with confidence. Oh, I could have just... Well, you know what, I want to take the scenic route, it's just weird. The scenic route is... This is close encounters. Of the Revenant kind! <laughs> he raps. He dabs on the service of hell. He goes down. He gets his victory royale with cheese. He buys the season pass. <laughs> Episode 3. <laughs> he buys the season pass. And now he can go and play in hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> okay, what's this gonna be? <laughs> <laughs> free, free gems, yeah. <laughs> uh, don't forget those microtransactions. <laughs> but going down to hell takes eight hours. If you want to speed this up, you can push. You can speed it up now for five gems. He goes down to hell, and it turns out to just be Bethesda's offices. <laughs> Welcome to hell! And then he has to play Fallout 76 for the rest of eternity. You know, no, no, you don't, you don't want to kill something, you have to, you have to play Fallout 76 forever. That's your punishment, Doom Guy. This is the real hell. Ah, oh, do I have to pick up that berserk? No, I don't. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Stop picking up the... Stop getting damaged by rad sectors. Uh, can we dodge this, please? Oh, excellent. I don't like that persuasement of the Zerg there. Just gonna throw it out there. Do we have to go down? Um... Yes, we do. Oh my god, well, that's a lot of enemies. No, damn it. No, no, no. No way, you think poop. Oh my god, what is it? And now, let me go up. Let me go up. Let me go up. Let me go up. I'm killing you as well because of infinite height or something. That's a mancubus! Ugh. Oh, okay. Oh god, no! Right in my face! I don't like this! I don't like this! Oh god, that's... Okay, I need to be a little smarter here. Okay, let's just take the stupid pack. Okay. Let's kill the imps so I don't get murdered by them when I go down into them. Radiation sector. Nah, I can all be the same at this point, Mr. Mina. Bethesda are dead to me. I want Bethesda to not have the new Doom license anymore, if possible. I'm still 
extremely weary of Doom Eternal, unfortunately, because of Bethesda being involved now. I will not. I can't even get. Remember, we have infinite height rules, so that means I have to deal with you know, a lot of vectors. And this is gonna suck. Um. Damn it. I need to I need to I need to fall down like yeah, this is better. In the corner, me. In the corner. Please don't walk at me now. That'll be good. Okay. There we go. Yes. 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 What song you singing there, Pineapple? There we go. We are safe now. Oh. Okay. Cool. Hey John, what would you think if Sunwast and Sunder were combined together? Sunwast and Sunder combined together. It's probably what it'd be called, Sunderwast. So what would that be like? Sunder length maps, Sunwast style difficulty? That would be an odd combination. I mean, Danny Bubinga has made large maps before, and Rivix is capable of making larger maps, but I don't think that's really Rivix's forte. He kind of prefers to make uh, small, fighty maps. It would probably be the most difficult thing ever. You could not imagine, like, Sunwast difficulty with Sunder's length. Sunderwast. <laughs> the great collaboration of Ribix, Danny Bubinga, and Insane Gazebo. John, you got in my mum's family Phobos rap out loud, it would be beautiful. What, you just made that up? I thought you were sing I thought you were quoting a song or something, Pineapple. Quite possibly. Alright. Uh, I don't know if... Uh... Should we try? Sure. Can't kill what ain't dead, is what the priest said. Wear it like armor, cause heck is high caliber. Bookshot is holy, cause be the glory. In space you can't scream, but it guts on the view screen. Full spectral assault, fantastic white gold. Heck is my asthma, I'll roll up my plasma. I freestyle. Yeah, I I did your little rap pineapple. Okay, this map was in very well as, as advertised by the map name. E D D. Very close quarters. And thank you for the one hundred bits pineapple. Did that say fuck censorship? Oh no. I've said a naughty word already. Oh, that's it. Time for you to close the stream up, okay? The, we can't be present anymore. <laughs> it's over. Close the stream. Go to bed. Tell your mom, apologize to your mom, and, uh, <laughs> you know, apologize right now that you're watching streams of all these horrible people. I mean, this streamer, and 
We all say Phobos here. This is the same text, isn't it? God damn it. It's not even censored, it's just fuck censorship right there. Censored. I see bricks everywhere. John! <laughs> Yay. That does count towards my donation, go. I'll have to remember to tally up the bits at the end of the stream and add it onto my ongoing list. Read above. BFG, my quickness and motion has got to be. We're going dead. Gotta shoot him in the head. Now I gotta go to bed. This is. Oh, this is slightly quirky. Oh no, Revenant's appeared. All in all, I'm just another brick one in the wall. <laughs> I think most of the thing is brick. Is that... I'm scared. There's a lot of revs. There's a lot, there's not a lot of cover. There's enough cover, but the rev count is high. I kind of need to keep moving to avoid getting squashed a little bit. You're not helping by cross-firing on me, buddy. I need all this plasma. Okay. Take a breather. Oh, it's an invisible wall. Damn, I can't go in the lava. That's kind of useless, you know. There we go. Alright. The rev count was high, but luckily the invisible walls were also in effect. Yeah. Alright. Beginning to feel a sense of slight quirkiness from this one. Oh, he's back. He's apologized to his mom. He's told Millie to go to bed for swearing. Now this is not a family family stream anymore. I'm not doing more raps. <laughs> Jeez. God. One brick, two brick, all these verbs are fucking. No, oh, that, that doesn't work, Mr. Mina. Revenants reviled, John's rectum defiled, not enough cover for John's derriere. Fire blue! Cacos too! Oh no, I'll pay that mental. Meatball Brigade, Meatball Brigade has arrived. Some time's over. Fun time's over, I said, damn it. Yeah, I fooled you all. There's no fire blue here. Yet. Oh, nice. Both the shotguns. Wait, not nice. Get out of here. Meat Ward from Aqua Teen Hunger Force. I don't watch that. So, does the title of this level have any significance on the level? Or was it just going for a deliberately sort of... This... Was it all just about the map game at this point? What does fuck censorship have to do with a level that's full of bricks, exactly? And invisible walls. <laughs> oh, I 
actually on top of the wall there. Oh no, it was a fountain. No. Not as exciting, perhaps. Oh no, the second one. And a third. And a fourth. Oh, they ran out. That's good. Wolfenstein textures? Yeah, but why would that be banned? I don't think that kind of stuff is... Well, first of all, that stuff isn't banned in Germany anymore either. Second of all, this is... Czech Republic, so... I don't, I don't, I'm, as far as I'm aware, I don't it's banned there. And third... No, I think they just did it for the sake of it. There might be a story behind this name. Who knows? Not that I will know it, because... There's no information about any of the maps, so... We have to sort of fill the blanks ourselves. What is the reason why this map is called Fox Censorship? I don't know. The map had a very bad day in the... The map had a very bad day working as a... Critic or something. Okay, good. I, I figured it had to be escapable. More rooms. It makes sense. Ah, doesn't make sense getting caught though. Oh, that's trial. Yeah, I could use that health now. There we go. That one is stuck. Yeah, I mean, map 29 of Sunwurst was called because Vivix had a hard day and just decided to say, fuck you. You know, I don't know. Rivix had enough. <laughs> Rivix had had enough of everyone. They're all pressuring him. But we the project, Rivix. So he's the project. And he says, fuck you. I'm not releasing the project. No. Never again. This midi is depressing. Yeah, a little downcast, I guess. It's kind of a shame I don't know what the music is. Again, there's no map information for this. This is just... Uh-oh. Uh, I need to switch my weapon real quick. Oh, dear. That didn't go very well. I didn't know they were coming from all the sides. Oh, well. Oh well, I'll just have to not do that a second time. No problem. It won't happen again. No. Alright then, Alpha. Seen him on Mr. Mina. Thanks for popping on by. God, it's uh, dead simple, kind of. Actually, there's dead simple tags, isn't it? This is map seven, after all. Yeah, I, I, I think I've just learned that the very hard way. Oh, God, that's a lot of enemies there. Oh, okay. A little reminiscent of uh, that one part in Monster Condo. So, 
Oh, okay. That's why it's called fuck censorship, because it's a SWAT sticker. But it's three quarters of it. So it's technically not a SWAT sticker. Even though apparently the SWAT sticker was originally a peace symbol for the East and therefore was co opted by the Nazis during the Second World War, ironically enough, and so it's actually not a and while it is a, obviously a symbol of the Nazis, it was originally a peace symbol. Oh, there we go. Now it's a SWAT sticker. I mean, it is a. That's a shape. But I think we know what context that our map of friend is using it in this particular case. Yeah, I don't think he's using it in that regard. I mean... There are apparently a lot of Eastern temples that have the symbol on their doors, so... <laughs> A lot of people going to the uh, Olympics in Tokyo next year, and for a bit of a surprise, this symbol is an Eastern, it's a peace symbol over there, so they're going to see a lot of these. By the way, I'm going to totally predict that come the Olympics, we're going to get a, a shitty, crappy article called Japanese are Nazis XD, and there's going to be a picture of a swastika of a temple. So I can't wait for that. But yeah, obviously in this case it was used in... Fuck censorship! So we did get our answer after all then. That being said, I would never use the symbol. <laughs> Unless I was depicting Nazis in this wad, of course. Interesting, uh, an interesting map though. Lots of brick. Even, even chucked in the dead simple esque thing there. To say it's a manji. So it looks like we're getting a bit of edginess occasionally. I mean, we had the entry gay and then that. So. We'll see. I mean, it is kind of thematic to one small part of Doom, so... But we'll see. Oh. Well, if that's the case, Spin Zigbench, be sure to disavow this stream immediately. John Sweepy, never heard of him. Pretty much. Yeah, identity politics is crazy these days, unfortunately. It's very sad, really. People looking for more and more excuses to divide each other. Very sad. This is kind of nice though. So far the levels I have seen from these mappers indicate some decent technical quality. I mean it's in all the maps yet, but it doesn't immediately screech really poor. Like lots of nice detailing. I haven't really to complain about so far. It's eight maps, eight, seven and a half maps in. Well, that being said, it, uh, Dan did say some of the mappers were experienced, some weren't. We'll see if that continues throughout the whole war. 
So far, I'm liking what I'm playing. It's not mind blowing. It's hard to do that with me since I've got a lot of Doom ones, so. I wish you have got a but it's, it's fun. That's part of the reason why I like playing wards by people I've not heard about. So no, you, you get that interesting thrill of discovering the next cool map you get to reference every week. <laughs> The next cool map that you can look forward to for something like that. Oh, Binji. Wow, I so. Then I need to label someone to shut down so it's concerned we get it as a destroyed easy when the deep contain the screwed me. Yeah, or to cover up the fact that your own argument sucks sometimes. Like, just label, every, just label all your critics as the extremists. Even when it's constructive criticism or stuff. Or berserk. Uh, yeah, I don't like that. Or berserk. Good job, Shane Gunner, you killed the Rev for me. I have a feeling we don't go there this shit. I just see a pit, I'm looking at the auto map. But... As I say that, I don't have anywhere else to go. Do I? Is that an actual wall? Oh, I guess we have to go down that pit then after all. Go up again. Yeah, American politics is fucking crazy. I am not looking forward to 2020 for you guys, but also for the rest of the internet. I've said this before, next year, the internet is going to have a major problem with its hands. We are in for a uh, big change. I think, one way or the other. All I can say is that if you're in your Amer if you're in America, hope you're prepared for next year. You might need to be. You don't sell out the left right paradigm. Piece of music choice here again. Them. 
almost a pinchy style level of pistol zombies there. That's why I call anything else. It's not quite as dense though, that's the only difference. It's like almost spread out, so it's not quite a pinchy of pistol zombies. Okay. Back we go again, I guess. Anti-Revenant Party. If such a party existed, I would join it. Anti-Revenant, doot doot. More like, fuck you. Any, any damage is too high. Am I supposed to have to do anything else here? I don't think jumping is on the table, so... What have I missed? Too late, Spinzig. It's too late now. The Pandora's box has been opened by me, I think. It's hard to ignore politics these days because everyone shoves them down everyone's throat. Okay, so now that's open. Progression in this level is a little off, a little weird. Not, not too straightforward, is it? I bet some people would find... Why? Well, I kind of did, to be fair. Make Revenants great again. Yeah. No! Ugh. Oh, what's that? What's that new meme? Oh, by the way... Can someone explain to me this meme? Because I, I've heard this once or twice now, and I don't understand. It's it's so, it's a meme where someone says, no step on snake. But it's like, done in a stupid elite speak, so it's like, no step on snake! Yeah, no step on snake, apparently. Oh, it's an old me. Okay. I just heard it a few times. Don't. This is definitely some odd progression. You go through the doors and then you keep going back here to access new things, I guess. Quirky. Now I know what the meme is. The Gazden flag is a historical American flag with a yellow field depicting a timber rattlesnake coiled and ready to strike. Positioned below the rattlesnake are the words, Don't tread on me. The flag is named after American general and politician Christopher Gadsden, who designed it in 1775 during the American Revolution. It was used by the Continental Marines as an early motto flag, along with the Moultrie flag. Uh, uh, oh, right, okay, it wasn't the Confederates, it was the other guys. Right, that would explain. And they say the left can't mean. So, don't step on snake is making fun of the flag. But why is that even being referenced then? Did someone bring up the flag as a historical thing and it was and turned into Don't step on snake! Oh, we're back here again. Still, we are no closer to figuring out where the bloody hell this red key is at. 
don't tread on me is a common phrase used by conservatives in the States. Oh, I see. So then the counter was don't step on snake. Or something like that. Oh wait, I'm actually well with this now. Hi. There it is, the last key. I'm free. I'm being mold. Absolutely butchered. Oh, it's not over yet. Ooh, this rock. I must have missed a rocket secret somewhere. Or somewhere. Oh. Now we're uh, backpedaling through the level, I guess. Interesting, I guess. Hmm. Ow! Probably the best thing to come out of that meme. Big fan of the stampedes, to be honest. Please don't squash me. Oh. There we go. The John Swag is a John Sweep yet angry and honest. Been don't use homing rockets at me. <laughs> that would be an interesting uh, pitch, as been saying. Don't pee on Pete! Don't ski on Sleet! Okay, so now I know where that's come. Could you please avoid my turf? Thanks! No step on Snick! So it's an old meme that came back into relevance recently. Well, that happens with memes sometimes, I guess. Oh, yes, that was pretty good. A uh, very quirky progression, though. One of figuring out which route opened up. Interesting. They're the interesting indeed. Still way to star. You're gonna be a star. Ow. No. <laughs> No. No. Ow. Ow. So many people around here. It's ridiculous. There we go. Come 
hiding in the exit elevator. Yeah, it was kind of dickish when uh, they started doing that in Spirit in later levels of Wolf 3D. And... Oh, we'll just put an enemy in the exit room. Haha, <laughs> fuck you. I wonder. Oh man. Oh man, oh god. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna ask you since I've played a few maps this now. You played this for the co-op sessions. What were your general thoughts on this ward? Having played through it in survival, what do you think of it? Oh I see, I'm just a background noise to your doom playing. Very good, sir. Very good. Done it now. Oh, no, I haven't. Castlevania music. Pretty fun, some unique maps. Some. Yeah, map 7 of this was definitely a little something. So a real mixed bag then, basically, Dubs. Yeah, I, I, I looked on the thread earlier, it said something about there was a map full of crates, apparently. I sense, that being said... That not back, man. That not back. Overall was good. Unfortunately, I couldn't tell you what music this is. Again, there's no text file or anything, so... I, I too like to, like to know what some of these music choices are. Or it's always nice when you get that little text file with the, the mapper's thoughts on it. No, it can't be, could it? It's gotta be some other similar. I just, I just realised something. Pipix. Um, let me just check something for a moment. I'm just typing it out there for my benefit. Let me just check on something. Uh, where is it? No, not that one. First one. Yeah, there it is. Give me a sec. I just realised something potentially. Um. Oh no, that was two different people. Fuck, I've heard that name before. That mapper name. Sorry, I thought for a set there was one of the Hell Revealed mappers, but that's Donny and Niv. I I swear I've seen that mapper name in something before. It might just be a common check name, but I swear that mapper name is familiar to me. It's, it's been bugging me. I'm trying to figure out what else has they done. Um, 
maybe not hell revealed, but something along those lines, perhaps. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. The reward. Pain and punishment. <laughs> Fuck you all! name it, it's familiar it's bugging me I know I've played something like that just that one mapper fire long range imp fireballs of me possibly air of sorrow falling garden that could be it No! Don't kill me, please! Quitonia 2. Yeah, maybe! Hello, Reflex! <coughs> run? What run? Oh, this is not for an Iron Man reflex. Although, I do have the Iron Man's ready to go at some point. Probably after I beat this, I'll do the Iron Man, I think. Nah, Iron Man this month is abscess. For the, uh, the League, anyway. And for Iron Eagle 13, I forget. Oh, okay, yeah. Fair enough. Well, thanks. Oh, you evil bastard. Oh. There's some fire blue. Twisty fire blue pillows. Yeah, you see, now the cutoff is a little more kind of works. It's still a bit weird, but it works a little better here. Because we couldn't play its high up or whatever. Yeah, there's been a few quirky levels in this so far. Nothing like it's super ridiculous, but there is a bit of edginess on occasion. So, some intrigue. I only get two. Let me try that. Sorry, this is going to bug me because I know I've. Let me have a look at that. Protonia two. I'm pretty sure it's not just that. I, I'm swear that name. I've come across that name before somewhere in another bigger project or something. Maybe twice even. Uh, let's see. No, that doesn't say the name of the file. I guess it's information from Fred or whatever. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, wait, that's a resource. What? No, oh, that's a resource. No, I want the, the map of names. I don't want this fucking DOS shit. Okay, here we go. Yes, you're right, Mike. There is a Pipix credited for Plutonia 2. He made part of map 3, and he did map 21, and helped with map 29. Yeah, okay. So, yes, a familiar face then. And he, and I'm sure I've seen him in some other project as well. So he's like the main name I can remember from that. So I have played his maps once or twice. I knew that name just... One gout at me as being familiar. Somewhere, and uh, there we go. Confirmation, yes. But it might have been a secret. Wasn't to be. 
Yeah, that would be nice. I mean, it's, it's a real, it must be a real pain for, like, people who want to do, like, sky, massive sprawling skies because you're limited by the sky's design. But then again, most people who do that usually just cover up the sky well, so... Um... Ah, right, here we go. Ooh. That is the best move I'm going to make all stream. Did you see that? Did you see how good that was? Did you see the way that I swerved around everything? Did you see how I've not been able to SSG down any of these geckos? So good. Oh, look, and there's... There's a hit with it. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, just kind of flung in there randomly. For some reason. Don't know why. But that's not uncommon for people who occasionally want to throw in the wolf 3D shit, I guess. Must be fans of Wolfenstein, that's the one. I got it up. Now, there is a a little bit of edginess to this one so far. Just a little bit. We had the first level was called Entry Gay. We had a level called Fox Censorship with the, the old swastika in it on the floor. Just a little bit of edginess here. I don't mind. It's it's not detracting from the quality of the level or anything. I know that edgy humor is not allowed in 2019, but no, it's really edgy when you're just using stuff that's in Doom anyway. I guess. But... Just a little bit of it in there. You just get a sense. Just a little bit. Chain gunner in the corner pocket. Another one! Ow! My health bar is suffering because of you. You do know that, right? That could have been. There's a mega spear. Only I was allowed to jump. Oh no, if only I was allowed. Oh, you're kidding me! I haven't saved in that long? Wow. Oh no, I had too much fun with the wad again. Gotta go all the way back. Yeah, this dam seems to be leaning towards the slightly more harder end of the map spectrum. He also seems to know how to map to do that. 
There I go, making that mistake again. Not saving the fucking game. In a while, and then I get killed by a... Well, hit scanners. Then I die, and I have to go all the way back five minutes. And clearly this is the, and clearly this is the wads fault instead of me. This is why I will never be a no-save guy. I could not imagine having... Unless the maps were small. No save. Now, but with the slight edginess, it means we'll have a bit of intrigue as to what's going to be coming up with the maps. Sergeants, no kidding. Now, I seem to have gone a different way this time. Ah, oh, same room, different entrance point. Nice. Mistake there, though. I'm guessing behind door number two, there's another one. Three percent health. Oh, you are kidding me. Well, I'm not going to go on three percent health with that. against two vials that show up. Fuck that shit. Now I need to save these rockets for the vial barrage that's coming up. So... Let's try not to lose our health to another rev barrage, if possible. Oh, 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 oh! Oh, yes. There we go. Not this time, boys! Not this time. No. Oh 
you think you're so clever firing before when the door peeks open? It's my trick. No fire, it's sweet. Okay, let's deal with these files. One imp rest. Not a bad outcome considering. Yeah, I. So, help me stay passage. No, it didn't. They tried to kill me instead. That's not what demons are supposed to do. I guess these demons are mortally challenged after all, huh? Especially this one. This one's bulimic. Or soul spitting. Goodbye stream quality, more ways than one. And there we go. Hmm. Poor me. <laughs> All right, that was a, another nice map as well. Really decent map so far. Really decent map so far. Could have been impressed, you might say. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna to the toilet, so I will be right back. Feel free to enjoy this menu music.
Alright, I am back. Hope you enjoyed the break. And we move on. Kafka-esque world. Alright. Kafka-esque world. Doom 1 music. Okie dokie. Jump back to playing more Doom. Damn it. Oh, what is wrong with me? Uh, what is going on? Why am I running into that? I remember when I was good at this game, it lasted five minutes. <laughs> I want to remember a time when I didn't eat Kako. I swear I did not deliberately run into either of those. Alright, whatever. You want to see some lust and Sunder combined. Yeah, we all want things. Yeah, I want I want I want Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance 3, but that's not happening. Although I could, although I could probably just play something else and it would just be the equivalent. But I want to be selfish and I want Dark Alliance 3. Because then I can do a wet split on it on YouTube and then I can get banned from YouTube finally. Not that I want to be banned from YouTube, of course, but. I don't really. I don't much care. In terms of content creation, I don't care much about it anymore. This is my content. Oh, I want a sequel to go in down, but unfortunately the author is a fucking... is doing shit with his life. I was actually tempted a few weeks ago when he released his new book to actually take a picture of his new book. Then send him a tweet and say, I will buy your new book on the condition you make a fucking Doom map. Or something. But the book wasn't in stock and I just forgot about it. I was that tempted though to like do that. I still could do that actually if I wanted to. They probably have it in Waterstones now. Go down, take a picture and say, I will buy this book if you make a fucking Doom map. But I and then, then I have to play it and it's fun. That could be my marketing pitch. Uh, going up. Dude, that would be great. I don't think Moldy's ever going to... In all seriousness, no, I... I, uh... Is there something down here? Oh, this is actually not dangerous. Okay. Well, this bit isn't, anyway. That is... Odd. Is it because it's Kafka-esque world, it's not poisonous? 
How is that Kafka? What's the, what's, the, what's the Kafka thing again? Subverting expectations or something like that? Uh, I know I, I should know what this term means, but I, I it's slipped my mind for some reason. Uh, oh, and I'm falling down here now. Oh, never mind that. Can I actually get out? Oh, I can. Dev, never. Where's my ex? How do I get it on with this devil? Yeah, no shit, I need a red key. Hmm. And there is the red key, but how do I get the red key? Ah! Oh, boy. Nah, but uh, I, I don't know if any of you have read one of some of my recent tweets lately, um, but I have uh, fully demonetized my... Oh, who's here? God, I'm an idiot. I have fully demonetized all my videos on YouTube. Like, I know in the past I used to run, like, Ads, I guess not like pop-up ones. I always made sure it was just a little title card at the bottom But there used to be ads on them and I've disabled monetization on all my videos and I won't be re-enabling it for any future ones, so As far as I'm aware For in the future when you watch any of my ad my videos There will be no ads on them At least none that I've set Texture being used there. Hmm, interesting. So hopefully, aside from any ads that Google may place on the uh, videos, you should see no more ads on my uh, YouTube stuff anymore. I'm still technically a YouTube partner from years ago. This is years ago, 2012 for some reason. I don't even know how I became a partner. I just was, I guess. I have ne I have never made a single penny off of that YouTube stuff. I mean, there probably is some a little tiny bit that I could get, but if to do that, I'd have to make a. Well, apparently nowadays you have to make an AdSense account, and no. I don't trust YouTube anymore. I'm not giving any of my details. Right, my God. So. I mean, I probably, I, 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 I don't know. I don't really care. I don't want to have monetization on my videos anymore in any small way, so I've disabled it and it's staying off. To be honest, I was thinking about doing this a while ago when I finally decided to do it after recent shenanigans. YouTube is just a train wreck waiting to happen. Oh, so we've got some running down the things here. 
cool. Huh, alright. That was interesting, I guess. Guess we'll find out what that arch wants all the way to. Oh, hold on a second. I just realized to put things back there. Yeah, you probably could have made it a little bit, but I don't want to bother. I mean, if I if I made like one hundred, two hundred dollars, so be it. But I don't care. I don't want to give them any details, really. So yeah, hopefully from now on, whenever this is uploaded to YouTube, you won't see any more ads on my videos. I mean, if there are ads, I didn't put them there, 100%. And that was all the past videos as well, not just the ones I've done. I've made sure every video was demonetized. The only ones that weren't were ones that were already claimed anyway, so I couldn't monetize them in the first place. But I have disabled all ads. There you go. Nice little uh, crate. Use, uh, this. I still hear this vial. I'm a little suspicious there. But now, nah, the golden age of the internet is over, by the way. In case it wasn't obvious. The golden age is over. As I saw in a video recently, but... Strife. Strife. I guess he means strafe. Strife. I mean, it's a good game, apparently. I've never played Strife, but oh, where's the archvile? It's come to bug me. He was just waiting for me. Oh, how f how nice of him. He was waiting for me. An old friend. But not really my friend. Barber. Like an irritating rival. Hmm. Oh, that actually was the exit. Yeah, well, if you want to find out, MTX, you have to make an AdSense account. But it's not worth it. I mean, okay, interesting. I need to check something. Uh, I, I swear I should know what Kafkaesque means. Um, comes from the author Kafka in the first of style. Oh, okay. Describes a nightmarish situation which most people can somehow relate to, although strongly surreal. Alright, yeah. Fuck. I don't really see much of a nightmare there, other than the fact that it was a nightmare where a new kid is in the pain sector. It was more like a pleasant world, but... Not really much surreal, but... You have your names. That's Fernance. Fernance. Alright. Sure. Fernance. Oh, wait, there it says Furnace. Guess it didn't. So he spelt it correctly in the map name, but it was a, a typo in the intermission screen tape or whatever. Alright. Sure. Bit weird. But yeah, the golden age of the internet is over. 
you know, if you're a, a new, if you're a new live streamer or a new YouTuber these days, unless you are willing to be the most bland advertiser friendly person, and even then you need to get ridiculously lucky, it's just not happening anymore. You know, it's just the way it is. Just makes me glad that I started live streaming when it was when the internet was good, you know. I got to be in the golden age when streaming was about making little nice communities over video games and stuff. Again, really nice level layouts. Whoa! Yeah, but that 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 logo is no longer relevant. It's not broadcast yourself, it's broadcast the mainstream media. And advertiser friendly friends of the mainstream media. I can't go. That's the way it is. People turn to the internet to escape from all the mainstream media stuff as an alternative. The alternative becomes mainstream. And here we are. It's only a matter of time before it turned out that way, though. Because the alternative is not exactly pleasant. Kinikos. People, the alternative to that system is a system where people think they would make everything better, but in reality wouldn't. Not all the improvements have been bad. Live streaming's been cool. I don't think I wanna I don't think I wanna go back to a pier before there wasn't a live streaming thing. Nuh -uh. I don't know if it's safe to go down or not. Oh, Oh, view. Yeah, that means... That would mean... Uh, extinction of the species, though, Kinikos, because if we were all given the reins of that absolute power, we would all end up making a dictatorship. That's the thing. They say, let's go down the path of socialism or whatever. They have noble intentions, sure, in part, but at all, at the end of the day, you're just another dictator in the wall. The way I see it, capitalism has its flaws. The alternative isn't better, however, no matter what some people think. Under a different system, that wouldn't change, though. I thought I might have had some benefit to coming down here, but... Not to deal with these revs. Please don't be right next to me on the top of the steps! No, they weren't. They were the good boys. That was one slippery skeleton. I tell you. Very slippery. Slippery like a fox. <laughs> Ten years down the road's gonna be interesting, I tell you. 
next year is going to be interesting. Whether we like it or not. Oh no. Oh no! Pinky Swarm. I'm not using a chainsaw. Yet. It's not nearly as efficient as just blasting them with this. Both bows for you bastards! Now that's not to say there isn't still good content on YouTube. There is, obviously. You know, you still got Sibby and others. But for people who want to get into the business now, I guess, it's a lot. It's just not going to happen. You know. It's a good thing we have a nice established pool of good creators, though, already. That's the one saving grace. We have the existing ones, the ones who managed to gain there before it, before it was too far gone, so we can still get some entertainment. But future creators are pretty fucked. You know. Um, can I walk onto that? Uh, I'm willing to bet that's void glidable, but not an option for me right now, clearly. <laughs> the future of video gaming comes now. What's this? <laughs> what is this, skinny ghost? Cube? Oh my goodness. It's coming. A game unlike anything you've ever seen. Prepare yourself for Cube. Cube. In development for over a decade. Cube will take you to a whole new dimension of computer games. Cube! <laughs> Featuring the latest in 3D pictures and the newest technologies that make calculators look like the cotton gin. Cube! Pick up your control switch and enter another world. You are now Cube, defender of the polyverse. Collect the diamonds and reach the goal. Every goal leads to a new color level. Blue, green, orange. The fun cannot be halted. Cube. Oh. But be careful. You will face many obstructions in your path. It's up to you to guide Cube around the things that Cube can't go through. Oh no. Cube. And just Look maybe, out. if you're brave enough and enough of a game master, you will reach level red where you will face the dreaded cone game master epic battle commence cube coming to your neighborhood dimension Soon. Cube. Only available on the Monotech Power Game Unit. Monotech. Game Future. <laughs> okay. I probably would play a game like that. Just a silly abstract cube going around doing stuff. Sure. Oh, 
uh, I suspect I have seen that video before, but it's not been it's been it's been a while. Yeah. Well, you know what to do, then, Kinikos. Maybe there was. Maybe someone did do something like that in 2006. 2006. Damn. Oh, look at this tag team. I'll give you a high five, but I just killed you. So. Sorry, man. Spyro with dragon. Well, hey, that'd be something that might be right up Pineapple's Alley. She likes to do... She's done a few recreations of old classic game stuff in the past. Zelda 2. If there was one person I would ask to do that, Pineapple would be it. Honestly. I would play a Spyro... Ward for Doom. Absolutely. I think that will be great. Oh no, there are Kako Demons. Cube! Plenty of Kakos, yeah. I mean... Yeah. I think I'm kind of lucky. If, if I had been, if I had started streaming like two or three years ago, just started out two or three years ago as a Doom streamer, I don't think I would have more than a hundred followers right now. I think I would be very, very much. A tiny, tiny fucking channel. So I got lucky, but I started. I was a streamer in my in the peak years, the good years. If you're like a if starting live streamer now, God help you. You are really you're not, you're you're gonna go nowhere. It's unfortunate, but it's true. All the ones who will profit from YouTube and Twitch stuff will be people who are already there. Or those who happen to be in the right spot at the right time. But that point involves living in America. Um... Right, are we... Go for you now? Looks like we can. Nice item placement too in these levels. I must add. This level. There's really a lot of care put into the design here. This is some good shit so far. That being said, I'm kind of glad I'm not doing this as a, a full time job type of thing at this point. Like, you know, could you imagine how many hoops I'd have to jump through nowadays? To avoid being turned into that hip. Get out of here. That could have gone better. Yo, is the whole reason you know about that old cube video? Whoa! Holy, 25% health! I'm not dead yet. I'm not dead yet, but that. 
Hitskin, I can't actually see where it is, might have something to say about it. I don't know where he is, Chief. Oh, it's there. Uh. Please tell me that's over. Oh, no! Okay, I think I'm... I think I'm okay. I think. Wow, they were hidden right in the uh, back wall of the tech there. I'm going to save now so I don't screw this up and die or something. But yeah, I, I will keep it. I started out when I came here with a bit of a, a, a small audience already around and I've sort of built on that since. Damn it. What's well, not two of them? Oh, there's a second one. Where'd he go? Oh shit, he's right. Oh! Fuck me. I got the fucking angle just a little off. Please don't do that, sir. Please don't do that. Stop. Stop! Oh god. Stay in there. Uh, all right. Nice. Vodster or Jacob Razik? No, no, those names uh, aren't on the uh, the way. Again, sorry, I'm just gonna link it again. No, um, no, the uh, the mapper list is damned. Enkele, Sulfuric, Jaden, Pipix made one map. Kowalki, 38, and Muzalek. No Gusta. So, the only familiar face for me is Pipex because I. He's made some stuff. It took me a while to figure out he'd made a Plutonia 2 map or two. The others. I'll be damned if I know that, what they've done. Some of these. It's a wide variety of experience from the. Very, very experienced as people starting out. Looks like we're going to see some of the uh, one mappers later on, I guess. Alright. Does Custer still make maps, though? Got <laughs> chingers on distant high wedges. Now the one thing I remember Quitonia 2 for is too many MBLs. How to ruin hunted with MBLs everywhere. The map set. Oh well, how to neuter it anyway. Wow, so it's been a while. But nice of it to come back and make a map. We've had a few older mappers come back recently. We had, um, what was his face? Mr. Eternal Doom Guy. He's come back, and he's actually threatening to make more Eternal Doom like stuff for the modern year, the, the mad lad. Hey, Henry CZ. The mod about check matches. <laughs> Probably because it was released to very little fanfare. I mean, people played it around the time for a little bit, but then it just... That was it. I'm guessing you are a... Uh, from the Czech Republic. Okay, so... I seem to have done a very good job of getting myself lost here. I'm trying to figure out the magic. So whatever I've missed somewhere. Okay, is it is it is it in the archfile room? Oh, there we go. Well, now I feel stupid. Hey, Hank. Yeah! 
It was doing a play test session. I played the um, one of his works. I forget the mapper's name. I think it was one. Of, but he basically said he was going to make a new ward. It was going to be very much like Eternal Doom ish, but with modern stuff. They had come back after years of not doing mapping stuff. This is... This section's called Too Many Pain Elementals. One is usually too many. Alright, I think we're clear. But it's not over yet. There's one enemy remaining somewhere. We now have all four sections of the bridge raised. Still can't squeeze in the exit though. Maybe you'll recognize some check mapping quirks then. I'm not so sure if I've noticed any in particular other than the odd use of Wolfenstein 3D stuff, but that's hardly... I wonder if we'll see anything like that. Is there a check mapper quirk? Like Russians with their over detailing, Japanese with... Sure, actually, if they had a quirk either, they have some good mappers. Oh god, I'm I'm flaring around. What a, what did I unlock? Is it maybe down in the pit somewhere now? Maybe, maybe, maybe. No, I don't know. I don't know. Need some blast for ah, oh, I. I pressed that. Some pain elemental showed up. Ridges race. Is there one I haven't been across that I just completely overlooked or something? Figure out where I've not been yet. Not glad checks made the per Doom Perv mod. What H Doom? H Doom is the Doom community's dirty secret pleasure. Fun fact I actually have played H Doom a little bit. I don't really fucking get what the gameplay is supposed to be, except that it's not really meant to be about the gameplay. It's not finished either. It's basically just... I think it's like, though, I think it's designed to be like those, um... Hentai games, where it's not about the actual gameplay, it's just an excuse to fat to a bunch of weird situations for five minutes. Like a game where... You, You play an RPG maker game, and then the idea is that the, the, the enemy is a big giant female and she squashes you, and you get off to that or something. Hey, Dying Camel and Mega Lego Smuggler. By the way, Mega Lego Smuggler, I am using your title at the beginning of my streams now. For the lack of anything better at the moment. A Molder Mod? I, I, I'm, I'm lost. I, 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 I am fucking stumped. Okay. It's not there. Is it anything to do with these areas, maybe? Or do I have to go back to the start for some shit now, or? Yeah, I've been used it at the start of this one, and I used it at the start of Spyro 2, the final one, yeah. Until I've, until someone provides better. 
I couldn't think of any... I didn't really want to make any title cards of my own. Because I kind of want it to be like a fan art sort of thing at the beginning of the stream. You know, so that people can create some MS Paint thing and I'll show it. That's the idea. Like, it's not going to be something I make. It's what others make and kind of show it off a bit. It doesn't even have to be anything too fancy. You could just whip up something in MS Paint in two minutes and if I find it hilarious, I'll put it as the next thing at the start of streams. It's a new thing I'm doing. It's not quite as fancy as a dying camel transition, but it's a thing. I'm lost. Help. I'm I'm not willing to blame the map because it this seems like a case where I've just missed something bloody obvious or semi-obvious or one quarter obvious or can I just like this is the exit I wonder I want to try something since we have this let me try something no that's not it no that's not like no, not quite gonna. Mm. Oh, damn. That should work if I get it right. Okay, it would work if I was sliding, maybe. That doesn't help. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, this isn't working. I was going to try and death slide into it. What the fuck have I missed? Help! Henry, you... Herney. What do you Henry? It's Herney. Herney, help! I need... You're the only check person here. What do I do? <laughs> ah! Oh, for God's sake, there's a switch there. Um, uh, Save some time with that shit. Ugh. Oh, look! A mastermind on the exit! Alright, who do I have to... Who do I have to hit with a wet fish? Who suggested that earlier? Oh, a spider mastermind on the exit would be a nice idea. Fuck you! Fucking spinzig. And thank you for the follow, Herney C. CZ. Oh, right. Well, a bit. It's a bit problematic. Definitely a threat that demands to be, uh, well, you're not getting out of not killing it. It's walking the fucking exit, you see. There we go. Holy shit. Done. There, yeah, there, blast for ants. But really, it's just called Blast Furnace, but they didn't die. I guess they need to fix that in any future release candidate. Blast Furnace? Oh, it's Furnace. But yeah, I do play a lot of Doom Wards, Herney. Um, I also play some other stuff too. I am, I am starting to become more of a variety channel. Although Doom Wards is a, a significant part of what I do have been doing for years, so you will get a lot of Doom and old school FPS stuff here, but I am branching out into other games. 
this level for me... It was fine. I just don't know. I, I just got lost too many times in it. And I... Well, that's all my fault, really. Really like design this level. Really, this damned is a damned good mapper, I think. Oh, wait a minute. I'm not accepting this. Oh, we missed a trick here. Why isn't this in Czech Republic language? What, what is that? What is the language? That I'm going to... I'm going to fix that. Give me a sec here. Ugh, hold on. Uh, let's see. English to... Czechoslovakia. There we go. I'm loving that shit. Like, where's my Google Translate? Good old Google Translate. Okay. Give me a sec. Ah, damn it. I need to get the bloody thing off. Sorry. Okay. Bear with me, everyone. This will take a moment. They missed a trick here. They should have... They should have translated this to Ch Czechoslovakian for novelty value. It's just a generic text. Bear with me a moment. Okay, I think that's it. <laughs> Good luck with the language. Oh god, don't machine translate with a real check in the viewer list. Okay, so I'm going to attempt to take this in check now. Um, I apologize if I offend any Czechoslovakian people, but you, but in first you beat us in a football match recently, so. Uh, <laughs> That can be a conversation, I guess. Okay, so... I should probably show it on screen, actually. Give me a sec here. So I can show it on screen what I've got. Is there anything there that's particularly... Nope, there isn't. Let me see if I can fix this for a moment. Um, bear with me. Okay, there we go. That should do it. Okay. So, um... Here is what it uh, says. Do you know how to read? No, not a clue. Um, so according to this, uh, it should say, it's showing the English version, and what I'm supposed to be is, Vy how jeze, vaze vitezne umme umon sinero des de dvu et avdrakt ek evako dvuat zeme et uneknaut ze nokne mue. Nine jeste jreve krovek kitas Kateri Zuzdao na Tive de Planete. Kanablali Mutants, Mazos Vavi, Mimos Vestan, and Zeo Dusava, Zazvu Vazi, Zedini Zuzde. Zedite Z as Sakat Ma Na Smart, Obsa Ktez Jazte Zakalani, Zakalani. Obsenbak Posmake, Udvalande, Vaz Dias, Pravu Z, Zizmaru. 
Sensory the Kravi Zodavi Zlitros Nimok Zik Zemske Ivaz Poko Tam Pajute Mosne Butete Butete Moshi Zabrukrevat Zik Jezivich Zisitup Ksiezi Zagnania Jezi Sursi Vazho Lasnio Domo Vexeko Mesta Nedar Kro, he has the bed of the Pista de Vu. Prudamo abutted this boss to the ne, this the Vate Egved Viesate Seke, Rust Visade. Okay, <laughs> that's my best attempt at the translation of that. <laughs> well, Google makes sense, but his reading on words are not so bad. <laughs> a is long. T is t <laughs> Okay, that was my attempt. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, one of the hardest one. No shit, hard language. I'm not surprised. It's, that's quite a mouthful. Anyway, this is Nineveh. Yeah, they should have made that in check because of Aki, and it would have been cool. Do pretty. Yeah. There's something for you to clip and put on my Discord. Yeah, I've heard Cantonese is pretty hard. Or Japanese. There's like different kinds of it. I just wish to someone mango language where nobody understood it. Oh man. Get something fine done, you clowns. people to speak English, don't they? So they can go uh, abroad and... Yeah, I remember that. They get them to speak English and then they can go abroad and uh, do stuff. What's going on here? Oh, imps in fighting each other. Last very long, seems not much health, obviously. No, we need it. Wow, that one imp just like fried.
two of his friends and himself. Okay, launch would have been helpful. Earlier. Damn it, Mega Wiggle Smuggler! Now I can't get my Chinese money. I've lost I've lost my integrity, you know? Thanks a lot. Good. <laughs> oh god, I may have to chainsaw of evidence. How well will this go? Not bad. Will I get two? Come here, you. No, no, no punch, no punch. Yeah. Can honestly say, oh wow, is that area I can go down to as well, or is it going to be like invisible wall shit? Let me check. Oh, it's invisible wall. It's really nice scenery though. Very strict invisible wall. Don't fall off the wedge. Type deal. Yeah, they've been pretty decent so far. Made armor. Oh, that's cool. We'll wave back around. Yeah, they made armor, which in turn led to Daisy, which in turn means they inadvertently invented the Battle Royale genre. You monsters. You. Hope I know Mafia. For some reason, quite a while ago, I actually watched a long play of Mafia, and that game seemed kind of janky, but also in a way, a little... Wait a minute... This... This is... Okay, it's very weird. I went into this room and I swear I've played this map before. Is this that one map that wasn't original? They did say there was one map that wasn't original. I think I've played this map before. Just something about this room immediately was like, hang on, you've played this before. It just seems very familiar. I don't know what it's from, but... I don't know what's going to happen here, but just at that moment there, I just felt, hang on, this looks familiar. Yeah, it could be right. It's just that they said in the, uh, the, the thread that there was one map apparently that was not an original creation, just one. Uh, it could be right. Maybe it's just like when you think it's familiar, but it's not. 
I don't know, I just, just screamed just that moment there. Hang on, I played this, but I can't remember what from, so whatever. Yeah, it could just be a stand way out or something else. I really do like this detailing on the side though, all these little castles and a boat. Yeah, you're probably right. It's probably just a standard way and I'm just thinking of something else. Even if it is a map that's been reused, then I don't it's a fine map, so. Yeah, what does does that word mean anything? Nineveh is it a Czech Republic word thing? Does it mean anything at all? Okay, we press. Oh, I guess this gives us our exit. Hi, Archvale. And goodbye, Archvale. Oh man, the end of the level is like there. I deny you, I'm cheating. Ha! Take that. I'm gonna walk outside here for a bit. I actually built a staircase for this shit. And aligned it properly. Holy crap. Look at this. I wanna take a moment to look at this really nice scenery. Because do. Matthew 2 is half American, you think? Yeah. So, like, are there any cheat? Yeah, you won't see this otherwise. The face is invisible wall the rest of the map. I just want to see if there's anything like an Easter egg or something quirky out here. It's really nice you put a lot of time into the... I mean, it's some of this is probably copy-pasting the same building a bit, but... Still... Oh my god, there's even an outdoor bit. Huh. Alright. Yeah, could be. It would be interesting if this was a follow-up, wouldn't it? Huh, <laughs> getting the other way. I will charge in the other way as well. So, since you are a from the Czech, are there any particular quirks that Czech mappers do, Herney, at all? Like anything I should be on the eye out for, any particular stuff? Or you're not aware of anything like that? Castle climber. Now we go immediately from desert to fucking green, green, green. That's out. Yeah, as do I. So it's nice to have that continuity. Although, since this is individual maps, it doesn't really need to be. Yeah, it's just definitely pistol star designed. Continuous would probably find this a lot easier. We should probably mention. Oh my god, wow. This is. So we got a nice sense of scale going here. Well, be the biggest map yet. This is game over music. Ah. Well, this is right. I wonder if it's rise of the tree. I mean, I just wasn't aware it was the game over theme. <laughs> a game that's more fondly remembered for its music as opposed to the game itself. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure everyone says Rise of the Triad isn't that great of a game. I've never played Rise of the Triad, but I have played a tiny bit of the remake. And Cinema Viewer 2, it's an odd one. 
Maybe one day I'll get around to playing it. Perhaps. Just spawn a few demons there if you wanted to. But alright. Save it. Save it for later. Just one. Uh, apparently they made Zones of Fear, which is another one that apparently is simple. They may have come up with. I don't think I've played that. But a reference, it's not like... A lot of wards like using Rise of the Triad music. I'm not surprised Hell Revealed did, but when Hell Revealed came out, Rise of the Triad was like newish, and it would have been a great source for music. To this day, you're lucky to go five wards without encountering at least one five sort of modern-ish wards without hearing at least one Rise of a Tria track somewhere along the line. Kerber debut! <laughs> Make the revenants go away! God, thank you, this is... Hey, they can help. Maybe. Hey, Rips, why don't you fire one of those whole run projectiles you like to shoot so much? I have a rocket launcher. Maybe I should use that. Oh, I forgot to do it. Damn. Sorry. Hey, Steve. How you doing? So, Steve, I guess it was your turn to uh, bribe Alfonso this month, huh? Look at you getting a frigging map pick for the Iron Man Wii. Curvis and Anato. Yeah, Steve D's abscess got picked for the Iron Man League this month. So I will be playing that. I think once I finish this, I will do the Iron Man's next before we go back to Spiro. Maybe. I might wait a little longer on the third in the series, actually. Maybe. Might play quite a bit of Doom stuff a little bit. It's only six maps, right? Depending on how long it is, I might make it a full playthrough and an Iron Man run, but we'll see. I'm not promising anything. My mean don't so easy to learn. I don't know. Well, that door's not opening. Hmm. Okay, what obvious shit have I... It wasn't the most obvious, but it was painfully enough. Ow, 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 ow! Chain gunner. Where is chain gunner? Oh god, he's up there! Uh, uh, imp, please! No! No, 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 no! No, imp. Stop. Buddy, 
The bloody head scanner brigade again. What's all this madness? Ugh. No! No fire at me! Or whatever. Sukabia! Jai Helvete! Orange man bad! Do I save on 4% health? Yeah, I guess I do. Don't try this at home or anywhere else for that matter. Don't do it. This will lead to time to play extremely passively. It's not fun. Oh god. Shackles, rise up! You'll regret this save. Uh, I'm gonna... I might do, Steve. I might. Really? I didn't think it was Russian, actually. Antiquated. Oh, I can get out of that. Oh, look at that, a health kit. Oh, look at another health kit. Where's the regret now, Steve? Where's the regret now, Steve? No regret. No regret. No remorse. No regret. More invisible wall. Oh. No, no, no invisible walls this time. This time, actual... area. Oh, wow, we got... Hey, yeah, thanks for the host, Video Gamer Games. How you doing? Welcome to map 13 of the checkbox. It's made by a bunch of checks. I guess I was supposed to be able to... Oh, look at that. Swerve. Oh, there's nothing here. Except this. Portal. Yep, your picture went south. And I'm coming for your ward abscess, whatever it is. Gonna involve... Crazy shenanigans am I gonna get from abscess? I didn't even hear the that one. I imagine it's gonna... Apparently it's not even gonna have caco swarms in it, so I don't even believe it's a real Steve D ward. Although apparently it's an old ward from... A while back ish. Does anyone want a language challenge? Let's challenge. Let's shoot switches. Oh, I see. You shoot for the first. Hey, look, the exit's beyond that giant fleshy wall. No pressure, then. Yeah, oh, nice. Oh, oh, what, what's this? Shooting switch? Another one? Shooting switches at a cell period in the level? Who do you think you are, John Romero? Stop with this madness. Shooting switches and then having setups to set up for more shooting switches. That's a secret, isn't it? That's how not to dodge him, Fireball. Wimpy 90s maps. Yeah, but you just said 90s map, which means... Which means... Well... It could be wimpy, but... It's a 90s... It's 90s mapping! So, anything else could happen as well. That's not a secret! Or maybe it is. But it's not open that easily. Oh. Okay. 
Oh, wow. Big yikes. Many yikes. Yeah, they've, um... They've kind of struggled to deal with the tiling sky a few times. Sometimes it's not been to the detriment of the visuals. Other times... Less so. It, it's kind of... They seem to struggle in really, like... Making sure that it's... Hey, Jimmy12. Indeed, I like it too. I mean, it's always cool to climb up something gradually. You know, some of the best maps, epic scale maps, have been climbing up something, you know? Like Hag's Finger, Map 29 of Hellbound. Something really cool about just climbing up a tower. map of legacy of legacy of something was it like a legacy of suffering yeah that was it legacy of no I was... no not legacy of something that's something else um ultimate torture and torment that was it the tormentor 667 thing Mareno Reknet Rur. Mary Say We. They all seem adept at scenery. Yeah, detailing has been on point so far. Quality is generally high. That's with boot. Oh, wow. The clutch dodge. And it really was a clutch dodge. I don't think I was going to die there, but I was going to lose a good chunk of my remaining health. Yeah, the Towering Sky... Yeah, yeah, it's not... It's there. Seems like check mapping is all about the detailing. But, unfor but unfortunately, now that I know that Gusto is check, I have to deduct 2,000 points because fuck you for making Hell Revealed. So you lose all your points, and I say good day to you, sir. Sorry, well, never mind then. I always, I always get that mixed up. Why do I always get that mixed up? How? I guess I just, I guess I just, um, blank out what the mapper's name each time or something. Yeah, that's it, Karma Sutra, which I've never played. Never played that. Single player, that is.
many dead head scans. I'm only kidding now, I mean, even if they hadn't made it, I wasn't really going to criticize them for that. I have got to play Karma Sutra someday. I'll play map 30 on Twitch and see if it stays up. Shotgun Symphony 2. I'm still waiting to play Realms of Intensified Chaos. Never mind Shotgun Symphony 2. Realms of Intensified Chaos was promised seven years ago when I first started streaming here. While I was playing the original Realms of Chaos. And ever since then, I've always been waiting for the day to play this remake of Steve D's old passion project. You are you're starting to ha you're starting to get into more death territory here, Steve. You are really starting to get into more death territory. Granted, I may be the only person who actually wants, who actually really cares for this realm's intensified chaos, but I'm a, I'm a noisy individual when I want to be. Sometimes not for the best of reasons. I am getting slight hellbound flashbacks with this level of detailing, honestly. And the fact there was no trap on the key there. I'm getting, this is reminding me a little bit of the Hellbound level of detailing. Minus some of the scale. This is quality shit. Right here, this is damned. I think it's damned to make this one. We got some good mappers here. This might be a, this might be a gem. I'm gonna wink it again. More people need to play this. Go play. Give feedback. Joy, I think. Oh, I can't actually get over there. Alright, fine. Ah, no! More souls. In finding each other more. Yes. Oh, I know they're not all gone. Yeah, I knew you were there. I knew you were fucking waiting. You sleaze bag. One map. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to be waiting for 2020 for that. Ow, ow, ow. Naughty. Oh, no. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, it's cool. Revenants cannot jump or fly, thankfully. <laughs> oh, Bloodstain. He did stuff for that too. I knew I recognized that name. Yeah, he made one map, Jimmy. One. One map. He's the only mapper on this list of mappers that I have played anything of before. Everyone else, this is all new to me. Fullback. 
Hmm. Oh man, all that is not a... More death territory would be fun away the way to eat it. Possibly. Yeah. For those who don't know what I refer to with more death, and maybe there's a chance some of you don't know, more death is basically the uh, Doom World's label given to projects that are high, are anticipated but don't come out and take years upon years. Basically, think Duke Nukem Forever, but for a Doom, what say? It was named Mordef because Mordef was one of the first, what well, was the first one to have this. Something that was highly advanced at the time, took years and years and never finished. That is why the reference for those who aren't aware of it previously. And I kid you not, Steve D has been working on that for probably about seven years. You can go back and look at my very old archive vods from 2013. I get hyped for it then, and the near I am, I'm still waiting, Steve. I'm still fucking waiting. Stop sipping boomer juice and make your damn ward already, Steve. Oh, I'm gonna. Sorry, I'm gonna cheat you there. To save time. Okay. Uh. So uh, shooty, shooty, switchy, thingy, something. I feel like I don't know what's going on here. What have I missed? I am a miserable failure. Hey, you got your one played for the Iron Man League. You did something this month. I don't know what to do here. Oh, God, I'm fucking lost again. Oh, here we go. There's an elevator. Of sorts. Gaston is still working on whatever. It's going to happen someday. Yeah, we'll see. No, it's an elevator that just takes me here. It's, uh, it's not quite the one I was hoping for. Fuck. Uh. Oh, I'm still. I'm still. <laughs> wow. That's a... If you want to go up here, there's a little switch to press. Ugh, <sighs> shit. Oh, there is a switch there. Ah. The archfire was masking another shoot switch. God damn it! Yeah, Skillsaw actually made a version of Valorant that works with mods. Because Skillsaw is very nice and generous. well don't. Oh, I'm gonna kill you now for that, son of a bitch. Hey! Don't distract me for my revenge! Yeah, I, uh... Oh, 
No, don't tell me I fucked something else up here. No! Oh no! I don't think I was supposed to fall down there. Or oh, was I? Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, what have I done? Yeah, there might have been. Uh, oh, I have magical powers! I shot that one. I'm probably just supposed to go back or something. Okay, fine. There's no clip. You happy? Oh, there's a shooting switch. Ah, oh, there we go. It's rising up the level a bit. Oh. oh no! Look how many souls have appeared. Uh, can I go through there? Yes, I can. Although I just fell down. Oh yeah, invisible in. Infinite heights, not invisible. Infinite height. That's the one I meant. Mount pain levels of lost souls. No pain elementals either. Just, a, just. We opened the the very very long gate of hell and out came a shit ton of these guys. Like, loads of them. Spewing out all over the place. I am really handling this not very well. Need to. Uh... John's not playing PR boom. Yeah, I'm playing with the boom strip compatibility because it mentioned uh, something I've been doing for a, a, a few times now. I'm starting to play with appropriate compatibility settings for different wads and stuff. I still. In some cases, I'm not a fan of infinite height, but I am willing. I am willing to be a little more lenient in some cases, though. But don't get me wrong. If it ends up, if it's a slaughter map, and it's all well, we'll we'll still see. But I might be a bit more accepting of it in some cases. Pining level will do. Yeah, like if it was a sword map, I probably wouldn't enable. It's just a thing. I thought maybe it was spelling out something behind it, but no. I only tend to no clip to save time walking up a level. But that's only if I know that it's not gonna like trigger anything. If it if I sense there's gonna be some trigger lines, if I revisit, I won't bother. It's just a time saving no clip. I don't actually use it to cheat stuff. I use it to save a bit of time for like tedious backtracks. If if there's nothing in the level that's a threat, 
The Street Cup level is good enough at this point, generally in what they are supposed to. Unless you're super anal about PR boot movement and other vanilla quirks. I am definitely not super anal about any of that. That was a really fun map. Honestly, a really, really fun map. These maps are getting better. I'm, I mean, this started out okay. It's, it's, it's getting, to, it's starting to get to good, really good status at the moment. But, Muzalek. Um, okay then. Oh, whoop, sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Of a rainbow. Hey, get cooped. How you doing? TNT music. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Yeah, I think that might be a nice map to leave for next time, though. Sorry, get cooped. You've joined at a very bad time, I'm afraid. I'm sorry. I'm gonna be wrapping up the stream now. But, uh, yeah, um, that was the first 13 maps of checkbox. Thoughts on the chat? Yeah, you liked it. Yeah, it's nice that they put it in there. I'm sorry, get cooped. <laughs> but I kind of, I, I think I, uh, I kind of wanted to weave this on a bit of a high, and that previous map was pretty sweet. And... I, th I think, to be honest, on some cases, I should probably try to s not go the distance because I do get fatigued. Like, if I feel, you know, I think three and a half hours is more than enough, <laughs> honestly. But, yeah. But it's not called Czechoslovakia anymore. It's a Czech Republic. Man, oh, I guess, yeah. But yeah, I've been uh, I, I've been I've been quite in, impressed with this so far. Um, generally, the maps are, the the I've had nothing to complain about at the moment. I um, mean, the maps are well designed visually, apart from just lacking that ability to close off the sky um, framing. Apart from that, really nice detailing throughout. Some interesting quirkiness, a little bit of edginess in places, and generally pleasurable maps to play at the moment. Yeah, I think you probably saw the best map I've played so far. I mean, there's been some interesting stuff in here. The maps are generally well made from what we've seen. I, I've seen so far. Um, I, I encourage more people to give us a try. If you haven't already played this, I want this one more time. Just a reminder. Uh, I'd really, I really hope that quite this, uh, it's, it deserves a little more exposure. You know, it may have had some in the initial release back in September. I think it deserves a few more people looking at this one because it's, it's some interesting shit so far, and we're only thirteen maps through. I am kind of curious to see what other quirkiness the checks can offer. I've enjoyed this. I had a feeling this might turn out to be a bit of a hidden gem kind of thing, and so far it's proven as such, but we'll see how it goes. I'm enjoying myself is the thing. It's been a really fun stream. I wanna I wanna I want this to be the my new standard for Doom stream, so I don't rage at stupid shit. I mean obviously I will be tested along the way, but you see this three and a half hours where I'm pretty chill most of the time and I kind of upset the deaths. I want that to be my new standard from now on. You know, it's not going to be great all the time, but I'm going to try. This is the kind of thing that I think is the best possible or among the best possible streaming experiences for you all. Where I'm playing a Doom Ward, which a lot of you like to watch. Where I'm enjoying the Doom Ward and I'm not getting too frustrated. But I am also talking about other random shit. <laughs> so, um, I will... Uh, continue this hopefully tomorrow night unless something comes up again if I do change my mind I will let you know on discord and on the twitter if you are on the discord or if you do follow me on twitter if you don't there's a link below for, for twitter but otherwise I hope to continue this tomorrow and I'm 
I'm curious to see what lies ahead. So thanks for watching and uh, have a good evening.